You recently had a VO2 max of 55, which is quite high. The VO2 max being like how much oxygen consumption yeah, yeah. your body can consume. So that's obviously a sign that your body is is peaking physically. And it seems like leading up to Wimbledon, uh, there were a lot of things trending in the right direction from a physiological standpoint. Well, I mean, I don't know how, maybe it's because uh, of my uh, biological age and, you know, <laughs> my body is like really working well. <laughs> Your whoop has inspired you. Yes, I love it. When I saw the numbers, I was like, "Did you guys actually did something in the system just so we I feel good?" No, we didn't do anything. You know, we didn't do anything. That's your real data. <laughs> How about when you get when you get a score that's a, like a bad score, but you have to perform? So remarkably, you had a twenty four percent red recovery at the final of the U.S. Open last year. <laughs> I mean, once again, I look at this as uh, as a normal situation. I've been per I've been playing for like two weeks, like high intensity matches, sure. and of course, like you know, it's tough to be like on the top of the recovery. And also, you know, body always have some extra. And I like when I saw that numbers, I wasn't sad or anything, and it didn't really affect my performance because I was like, well. I'll think about that later. I'll just like give it all, everything I have. And then after the match, I'll have like a few days to recover. So nothing to be worried about.